The Pokedex, alongside the entries, also tells us a bit about Pokemon's physical traits. It's all thanks to this that I now know what Gallade's feet look like, but they can also be categorized into the 14 different body shapes. And some of the classifications here are weird. This little bug dude makes sense. It represents lots of, well, bug types, but also Corsola? I guess it has the antenna. But those feet aren't even real feet. Look at this. This Wobbuffet looking thing is used for some Pokemon, and it makes sense for most of them. Even you just laugh if you uh, squint a bit. But Delmize? It hardly makes sense with the anchor, let alone the true body. Screw it, just give it its own category. This thing represents most quadrupedal Pokemon from things like Eevee all the way to Skeledurge, but also Meowth, even though it's mostly only ever standing on two legs. Oh wait, silly me, Galarian Meowth doesn't use the quadrupedal type and instead uses this. Well, that clears everything up. This body type is just full of weird stuff. Of course, there's lots of snakes and serpents, that much is obvious, but there's also Snom, who is not a serpent, and if it was, I'd be terrified. Mimikyu, so I guess that's what it looks like under there. And also Sandy Gas and Palo Sand? Oh yeah, I forgot about the fact that they could do this. And really weirdly, Burmese represented by that Wobbuffet shape again, even though under the cloak, it's... I'm sorry I asked.